Yoga from the scratch. Your first steps on the mat. In this series, you'll find all you need to know to move your body and mind in a healthy way. Align your bones and muscles. Understand movement. And relearn to breathe. Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of the Yoga for Beginner Sequences. Today we'll do a flow with a peak posture and it will be a balanced peak posture. So let's start right away whenever you're ready. Find a very comfortable seated position. You can rock your sit bones for a moment. And then come to stillness. With your inhalation roll your shoulders up to your ears. And as you exhale, roll your shoulders back and down, find an upright spine, close your eyes. And then just for a moment, bring your attention to your breath, observing without controlling. Recognizing how the air enters your body through the nostrils and how it leaves your body again. Maybe a little warmer on the exhalation. And then ask yourself the question, why are you here today? Why did you choose to sit down, take time for yourself? Move your body? How does it feel to commit to yourself? And you can be very proud for having done the first step. And then from here, start to deepen your inhalation. Through your nose, deeply inhale into your belly, ribs and chest. And then for your exhalation, open up your mouth. Two more times, inhale deeply through your nose. Exhale, open your mouth. Relax your shoulders one more time. Inhale deeply. And then if you can't inhale no more, hold your breath. Open your mouth and exhale. Really good. With your next inhalation, slowly start to open your eyes. And then bring your hands in front of you. Come to an all fours position. With your next inhalation, bring your tailbone up, belly down, chest forward, head up. Exhale, bring your tailbone down, belly in, chest to belly, head down. Inhale, bring your tailbone up, belly down, chest forward, head up. Exhale, tailbone down, belly in, chest down, head down. One more time, inhale. Exhale. Really push into the mat, create space between the mat and your body. And then with your next inhalation, come back center. And then from here, bring your seat down to your heels. Open your knees to the width of the mat and come down into child's pose. Extend your arms forward. Relax your forehead. And then bring a slightly lift to your center. Bring your belly button in and up. Active child's pose. Inhale here and exhale. Connect to your body, slowly start to stretch your spine, creating space in your back. And then with your inhalation, slowly come back up to all fours. And from here, walk your hands to the top of the mat until your chest drops down. Hard posture, hard to mat. Open up your chest. Open up your shoulders. One more deep inhalation. Exhale, 
Inhale, slide forward into Sphinx. Keep your elbows bent, close to your ribs. Bring your legs together. And then with your inhalation, open up your chest. Pull your shoulders back, shoulder blades together. And then as you exhale, start movement into, in your spine. Keep your legs straight and only move from the center of your body, from the core, the whole spine. Inhale, come to stillness. Exhale, slide your hands to your ribs. Inhale, push up. Keep your legs on the ground. Keep your upper glutes relaxed. And then also from here, start to move. Add movement from side to side. Inhale. Exhale, come back center. Push back up. Bring your seat up. Tuck your toes under. And come into your first downward facing dog. Keep your knees bent. Open your fingertips. Push your fingertips into the mat. And then as you inhale, bend your knees. Round forward into plank. Exhale, bend your knees again. Bring your belly to your thighs and push back up. Exhale here. Inhale, bend your knees. Push forward into plank. Extend your legs. Exhale, bend knees. Bring your belly to your thighs and push back up. Downward facing dog. One more time. Inhale, bend your knees. Roll forward. Exhale, bend your knees, belly to thighs, and push back up, downward facing dog. In this first downward facing dog, as always, keep your knees bent, add a little movement, maybe walk your feet, maybe drop your hips from side to side, whatever feels good, just to slowly warm up the body. Really open your fingers, push the fingertips into the mat, Inhale deeply, and then as you exhale, bend your knees, look between your hands. Take two to four steps to walk your feet in between your hands. Inhale, halfway lift, bring your hands on your shins. Exhale, release, fold forward. Inhale, bend your knees, and then slowly roll up, vertebra, vertebra. Bring your arms up overhead. Exhale, palms together in front of your heart. Take a deep inhalation here. Exhale, open your arms to the sides. And then prepare the mountain posture. Bring your legs together or hip roots distance apart. Ground down through your feet, have your feet parallel. Soften your knees. Bring your belly button in and up. Bring your shoulders back and down, chin back and the crown of your head up. From here, take another deep inhalation in. Exhale out. Start breathing in and out through your nose. And with your next inhalation, bring your arms up, open up your chest. Exhale, bend your knees, dive forward, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift, bring your shoulder blades together. Exhale, bend your knees, bring your hands down, step your left leg back, lunge. Push your right hips back, activate your back leg. Exhale, hands down, step your right leg back, downward facing dog. Inhale, bend your knees, shift your weight forward, come into plank. Exhale, drop your knees, bend your elbows, chest down. Inhale, slide forward, cobra. Exhale. Push back into child's pose, tuck your toes under, and come back up into downward facing dog. Stay here for two breaths. Start to connect to the earth from your feet. Bring your feet down, keep your knees soft, push your hips back and up. Then elongate through your shoulder blades. Turn your triceps in, fingers down, grounded. And with your next inhalation, bend your knees, look between your hands and bring your right foot in between your hands. Lunge, push your right hips back, left leg active. Left leg steps forward, inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, release, forward fold. Inhale, bend your knees, roll up, vertebra, vertebra, arms overhead. Exhale, release. Other side. Inhale, bring your arms up, elongate through your spine, 
Exhale, bend your knees, dive down. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, bend your knees, bring your hands down, step your right leg back, lunge on the other side. Inhale, push your left hips back, activate your right thigh, bring your hands down, and then step your left leg back, downward facing dog. Inhale, bend your knees, roll forward into plank, Exhale, drop your knees, bend your elbows, drop your chest. Inhale, slide forward, open up, cobra. And then from here, lift your legs up into upward facing dog, shoulders back. Exhale, roll over your toes, downward facing dog. Really good, stay for two breaths. Exhale. And to exhale. Inhale, bend your knees, look between your hands, step your left foot forward, right foot forward, halfway lift, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, bend your knees, swing your arms up to the sides, bring your palms together, exhale, come back center. Release your arms to the sides. Let's continue with the sun salutation B. As you inhale, bend your knees and swing your arms up. Hold it here. Exhale, release. Bring your hands down, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, bring your hands down. Step your right leg back, left leg. Shift your weight forward. And as you exhale, bend your elbows, come down. If you want, you can drop your knees. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, extend your right leg up. Exhale, bring your right knee into your chest. With control, step your right foot in between your hands. Push your right hips back. Prepare your left foot for warrior one. Left toes 45 degrees to the left side. As you inhale, bring your arms up. Open up your chest. Warrior one. Push your right hips back. Left hip forward. Belly button in, grow through the sternum. Inhale deeply, exhale, bring your hands back down, step your right leg back, plank, and from there, chaturanga as you exhale. Inhale, upward facing dog, exhale, downward facing dog. Other side, inhale, extend your left leg up, exhale, bend your left knee into your chest. Inhale, step your left leg forward. Prepare your right foot, warrior one. And then as you inhale, rise up. Left hip back, right thigh active. Extend your arms up, belly button in. Deep inhalation. Exhale, bring your hands back down. Step your left leg back. Shift forward into plank. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Really good, stay for two breaths. Equalize your inhalation and exhalation again. With your next inhalation, bend your knees, look between your hands, step forward, right leg, left leg, halfway lift as you inhale. Exhale, release, forward fold. Inhale, bend your knees, swing your arms up, and then hold it here. Inhale, exhale, release forward, swing your arms back, extend your legs, interlace your hands, and come down with your head. Inhale, bend your knees again, release your arms, bring your arms up. Exhale, release, bring your hands down, interlace your fingers, come down. Inhale, bend your knees, bring your arms forward. Stay for your inhalation. Exhale, bring your hands down. Open your feet to the width of the mat. Turn your toes outwards, heels inwards. Find a straight spine, tailbone down. Bring your hands into cups in front of you and then start to add movement. Move from one side to the other side. So we have a dynamic hip opening here. 
One more inhalation. Exhale, come back center. Bring your palms together. Push with your elbows against your knees. Grow through your spine. Deep inhalation, tailbone down. And exhale. One more inhalation. As you exhale, bring your hands behind your back. And then slowly drop down. From the grip of your app, bring your right knee up, left knee, feet together. Bring your belly as close to your thighs as possible. Right arm forward, left arm forward. Hold it here. Inhale deeply. Exhale, grow. Inhale deeply. Exhale, extend your legs. Come down, extend your arm overhead. Exhale, push back up, come back up. Inhale, release, come back down. Exhale, come back up. One more time. Inhale, come down. Exhale, come back up. Hold it here. Hold it. And then release the soles of your feet. Hands behind your back with your fingertips facing to the front. Counter posture to release our hip flexors. Inhale, lift your seat up. Bring it to your heels. And from there, push up. Open up your chest. Grow through your sternum. Try to keep your feet parallel. Deep inhalation and exhalation. And then lower your hips back down. And from here, open your feet again to the width of the mat. And then make your way back to the top into Malasana. From Malasana, we add a little arm balance. We already tried it last time, so bring your hands down, bend your elbows, try to bring your knees into your armpits, and then as you inhale, shift your weight forward, 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 until eventually your feet lift up and you come into the crow posture, Bakasana. Inhale deeply, give it a try, and then exhale, slowly come back down release and then from here simply bring your hands down step your legs back shift your weight forward exhale chaturanga inhale upward facing dog exhale downward facing dog inhale bend your knees slip between your hands step forward halfway lift exhale forward fold Inhale, bend your knees and slowly vertebra, vertebra, come up. Bring your arms up overhead. Exhale, hands to your heart and release. From here, really ground down through your feet. Bring your right hand into your right hip. Inhale, left arm goes up, first up high. And then as you exhale, over to the right side. Side body stretch on the left side. Inhale here. Exhale, circle your left arm back to your left hip. Right arm goes up, first up straight, and then exhale to the left side. Stay for your inhalation. Exhale, circle your right arm to the right hip. Left arm goes up, high first. Exhale to the right side. Inhale here. Exhale, circle your left arm back to the left hip one more time. Right arm goes up, up high first, and then circle to the left side. Inhale here. Exhale, come back center, release your arms. With your next inhalation, lift up the toes of your right foot. And then from your pinky, slowly bring them back down, really ground down through your right foot. As you inhale, bring your weight into your right foot and then slowly bring your left knee into your chest. Hold it here. Find length. Stay for two breaths. Find your balance. Find a gaze, a drishti in front of you, somewhere where your eyes rest, something that doesn't move. And exhale. With your next inhalation, open your left knee to the left side. Maybe bring your right hand into your right hip. And here we really try to keep our hips square. So we're opening our hips, 
pushing our hips forward. One more inhalation. Exhale. Inhale, come back center. Grab your left knee with your right hand. And then as you exhale, extend your left arm back. Find your balance. Maybe your gaze goes back as well. Inhale deeply. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, come back center. Bring your left hand back and then release your left leg. Perfect. Shake it out, give it a little rest. And then come back, grounding down through your left foot. So we first lift our left toes up and then from the pinky we bring them back down. Inhale, bring your weight into your left leg. And then bring your right knee up into your chest with your exhalation. Find your balance here. Exhale, find a gaze, something, some point that doesn't move so you can hold your balance, inhale. And then as you exhale, open your right knee to the right side, left hand into your left hip. And again, try to push your hip forward, stay square, stay stable. Inhale deeply. Exhale. Inhale, bring your right knee back to center, left hand on your right knee. And as you exhale, extend your right arm back. Find your balance, find a gaze on your back. Try to keep your hips square, inhale. Exhale. With your inhalation, bring your gaze back to the front, right arm forward. And then slowly release your right leg. Shake it out one more time. And then whenever you're ready, make it back to the top of your mat. Let's flow again and enter the wave, the wave of sequences where the main posture is included. With your next inhalation, raise your arms up, open up your chest. Exhale, bend your knees, dive forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, bring your hands down, step your right leg back, left leg, come into plank and then bend your elbows, come down Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, extend your right leg up. Exhale, bend your right knee. Bring your right knee up to the sky and bring your right foot closer to your glutes. Open up your chest, open up your hips. Inhale here. As you exhale, bring your right knee into your chest and then with control, step your right foot forward in between your hands. Push your right hip back, activate your left leg. Inhale, exhale, extend your right leg and look forward. Open up your chest and then fall down. Inhale, bend your right knee, look back up. Exhale, extend your right leg, fold forward. Push your right hip back. One more time, inhale, bend your right knee, look up, left leg active. Exhale, extend your right leg, fold forward, push your right hip back. Stay here, deep inhalation and exhalation. And then with your next exhalation, bend your right knee again, prepare your left foot 45 degrees warrior one. And as you inhale, come up, swing your arms up, and then exhale, circle your arms back. Inhale, bring your torso to the front. Inhale, bring your torso to the front. Circle your arms up. Exhale, open up. One more time. Inhale, circle your arms forward. Exhale, arms back. And then here, interlace your fingers behind your back. Keep the opening. And then as you exhale, fold forward, humble warrior. Bring your right shoulder to the inside of your right knee. Stay here to breath. Try to push your right hip back. And then with your next inhalation, slowly come back up. Extend your arms back up. Exhale, open into warrior two. Left leg goes back. Right arm forward, left hand back. Inhale here. As you exhale, extend your right leg, bend your left knee, come down into Skandasana on your left. Stay for your inhalation. 
Exhale, walk your hands back to the top of your mat. Right hip back, left thigh extended. Inhale, extend your right arm back while pushing the right hip back. Hold it here. And then exhale, bring your right hand down. Step your right leg back. Shift forward. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Really good. Let's move to the other side. Inhale, extend your left leg up. Keep your hips square. Exhale, bend your left knee, open your hips. Try to keep your torso straight. Bring your left knee closer to your glutes. Inhale, exhale, left knee into your chest. With control, step your left foot forward. As you inhale, extend your left leg and fold forward. Exhale here. Inhale, bend your left knee. Look forward, open your chest. Exhale, extend your left leg, fold forward. Push your left hips back. Inhale, bend your left knee, look up. Exhale, extend, fold forward, hold it here. Hold it here, push your left hip back. Straight hips. One inhalation and exhalation. Inhale, rebend your left knee. Prepare your right foot for warrior one. And then as you inhale, come up. Open up your chest. Exhale, circle your arms back. Open up. Inhale, bring your torso to your left knee. Swing your arms up. Exhale, circle back. Big circle. Inhale, come forward. Catch all of the breast oxygen here. Exhale, circle, open up. Interlace your fingers and keep on opening your chest. And then as you exhale, fold forward, humble warrior. Left shoulder to the inside of your left knee. Push your left hips back. Hold it here. Two breaths. Inhale, slowly come back up. Bring your arms to the front. Exhale, open up, warrior two, left arm forward, right arm back. Stay for your inhalation. Exhale, extend your left leg, bend your right knee, come down into Skandasana on your right side. Inhale, walk your hands back to the front. Push your left hips back, place down your right arm, and then extend your left arm up with your exhalation. Inhale here. Exhale, left hand down, step your left leg back, shift forward, exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Perfect. Drop your knees down, take a seat on your heels, bring your arms behind your back this time. Little moment here to rest. You can bring your knees together. Another variation of child's pose. Calm down your breath. Make sure that your inhalations and your exhalations last at the same time. Feel the energy rising, circulating in your body. Feel the air, the oxygen, Prana circulating in your body. And then from here, in your own pace, make your way back to downward facing dog. Let's meet here. Let's use this little moment to open our hips and then we'll come to the peak posture, balanced posture. And opening the hips hip joint circulations always support the balance, help us with the balanced postures. So as you inhale, extend your right leg up and then bend your right knee and then start to circle your right knee. Really open your hip with every circle. Three circles to each side. Open up three and then change direction. Perfect, use all the space you got here. And once you're ready, extend your leg, bring it back down. Other side, inhale, extend your left leg. 
bend your left knee and then start to circle, opening your hips. Three circles to each side and then change direction. One more. And whenever you're ready, extend your left leg again. Exhale, bring it down. Inhale, look between your hands. Step your right foot to the outside of your right hand. Left foot to the outside of your left hand. Drop your hips down, look up. And then as you exhale, bring your hips up. Extend your legs. Grab the opposite elbows and loosen up here. Really rotate from side to side. Can keep your knees bent. Inhale. Exhale, release your arms and then slowly bend your knees. Vertebra, vertebra, come back up. Bring your legs back, hip roots distance apart, and we'll move to our final peak posture. We already prepared our body with a balanced posture before, and now we go a tiny little bit further. So ground down through your right leg with your inhalation, bring your weight into your right foot and then bring your left knee up. And you can either stay here and repeat the same exercise, right hand to your right hip. Or you can try to grab your left big toe with your peace fingers and then extend your left leg. Really good. Hold it here. Push your left hip down. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, open your left leg to the left side, keep your hips down and maybe bring your gaze to the right side, inhale, exhale, one more time, inhale, exhale and then bring your left leg back. And see, this is the biggest challenge. If you can grab the outside of your left foot with your right hand and then extend your left arm back and eventually bring your gaze back. Hold it here. Difficult posture. Find your balance. Inhale. And then exhale, slowly come back center. Release your left leg slowly and shake it out. Really good. Really good. Let's come to the other side. Ground down through your left leg. Bring your weight into your left leg. Right knee into your chest. You can stay here or you can grab your right big toe with your peace fingers. And then as you inhale, extend your right leg. Hold it here to breath. Exhale, push your right hip down. Keep your hips square. One more inhalation. And then as you exhale, open your right leg to the right side. And by the way, you can do the same if you have your knee bent into your chest. You just simply open your knee to the right side. Hold it here. One more deep inhalation. Exhale, bring your right leg back. Exhale, hold it here. Eventually grab the knife edge of your right foot with your left hand, extend your leg and bring your right arm back. Stable on your left leg, gaze goes back or to the front. Deep inhalation and exhalation. And with your next inhalation, come back center and then release your right foot, but really slowly come down. Release your right foot, but really slowly come down. Really good. We come back to the top of our mat. And from here, we take one more flow, one more vinyasa to go down on the ground. Take a little twist, a little stretch, and then relax in Shavasana. So inhale one more time. Extend your arms up. Find length. Exhale, bend your knees. Dive forward. Inhale, halfway lift, open up your chest. Exhale, bend your knees, bring your hands down. This time, step back with your left leg first. Right leg, shift your weight forward. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Really good. 
and then from here simply bring your right knee down cross your feet left leg down and come to seated from here extend your right leg forward bring your left foot over to the right side left arm is on your back inhale extend your right arm up exhale right elbow behind your left knee grow exhale twist we really ground down through our sit bones and the twist starts in your core so use your inhalations to lengthen and your exhalations to twist gaze goes back right foot is in flex inhale here exhale release come back center change sides extend your left leg bend your right knee step over with your left foot to the right side inhale extend your left arm up exhale bend your left elbow in front of your left knee ground your sit bones down inhale find length exhale twist to the back inhale open up exhale twist a little more one more time inhale open find length exhale twist inhale slowly come back center release bring the soles of your feet together and then from here as you inhale extend your arms forward exhale slowly make your way down on a mat plant down the soles of your feet hip roots distance apart arms to the sides and then just let your knees drop from side to side windshield wiper releasing any tension of our hips really good inhale come back center and then bend your knees into your chest hug yourself hug your knees bring your forehead to your knees give yourself a big hug grab your knees and then roll from side to side forward backward to massage your lower back and then bring your head down extend your arms in the center of your knees grab your feet from the outside and then as you inhale your feet push up and your hands pull down so we come into happy baby posture and from here we can roll from side to side giving our lower back a quick massage really rejuvenating posture if you want you can try to extend one leg the other leg whatever feels good for you here whatever makes you happy whatever makes you feel good in the end of the practice and then as you inhale slowly come back center bring the soles of your feet back down to the ground and then from here simply extend your legs let your feet drop to the sides arms with your palms facing next to you close down your eyes feel your body feel the energy rising and then take another deep inhalation in inhale even more and then hold your breath exhale open your mouth let your breath flow naturally again feel how your body gets heavy how your body surrenders completely to the mat and just give yourself time for a rest a rest where your cells can recover, rejuvenate. A rest where you don't have to do anything else, but be present and enjoy this very moment with a smile inside of you and the gratitude for you showing up for yourself. Feel free to stay here as long as you want. Maybe meditate, maybe just enjoy the rest. 
Thank you so much for practicing with me, for your trust, for your consistency. Have a beautiful rest of your day and I'm excited to see you in the next practice. Namaste. I hope you really enjoyed stepping on your mat for the first time, moving your body, connecting to your breath, and you probably felt some muscles that you've never felt before, but that's all right. Consistency makes up for success. So if you like the practice, I'd be really happy if you gave me a thumb up. And also if you shared the practice with someone that you think could like it, could enjoy it as well as you did. See you around.